Feel better. Welcome back to Boomer Hair TV. The heavy and sickers show. If you're new yeah. to the channel, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Right, sickers. Hey, yo, welcome. Well hey, dude. I'm good, Mark. I can't wait to get into this episode, man. Like, this is, my, this is like the highlight of my day at the moment, man. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you. So, this is this right, yeah? So, I've just done a video with Mickey Theo. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We were just talking about, you know, about the, the, the John Fury video. All you guys can watch it. It's the, it's the video before this. And basically, what he's saying is, in a nutshell, um, he's in the dark. He doesn't know if the fight's on or off. And he says the fans deserve to know if the, if, if the fight's on. Now, I sort of kind of agree with him because really, truly, I invested a lot of time into this. Mm. A lot of time into this, and, and I'm sure a lot of fight fans have. It's like EastEnders, you know what I mean? We, it's a cliffhanger right now. We want to know, we want, we want some sort of result. We want some sort of resolution. We want to know what's going to happen next. You can't leave us yeah. like this. John Fury, let us know what's happening. We need to know, is the fight off or is it off? No one knows. John, Mickey Field doesn't know. Um, John Fury's um, agent, um, Spencer Brown. Um, uh, Mickey Fields asked him to make the statement. What do you think about this? I don't think John, John has to say anything. I don't what? think John has to let people know because he's the one that's gave it most attention. We're in lockdown anyway. We know nothing can't happen until the government say. So there's not, no, it's not really any rush. You know what I'm saying? There's not really no rush. There's no rush. You're right. But the fact of the matter is, um, still, we'd like to know. Is it off? Yeah, we do, but we don't. We, don't, we, 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 we I would like to know in the Premier League. Well, I know. It's... Would you like to know if the fight's going to be on? Come on, honestly. And I, I, I know the fight's not on. You know that? How do you know that? Because John said the other day he's not fighting in the ring. He said, I'm not, I'm not looking like an idiot in the ring the other day. John's not a liar. He said, Listen, I don't want to fight you in the ring. Yeah, but, yeah, but what I'm trying to say is, Mickey Fear was saying that's not a good enough reason. There must be something more. Okay. Mickey, yeah, well, he, John, John can speak at his own time then. John, see John. John is the main player in this whole thing. Why are you calling him by He's got first the name power. Like huh? Why are you calling him by his first name like you know? <laughs> Me and John are tight, bro. Me and John are tight. No, man, long one. You go way back, I say. Yeah, we, 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 bro, listen, I was there. I was there. We, I was there with him. I was, I've been there. Wait, 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 John. Huh? Where was you there? I was there, bro. Listen, when, when, when he did a bit of porridge, I was there. When... <laughs> hey, you see John? Yeah. Mickey Fio needs John. John don't need Mickey Fio, bro. So, don't keep pushing John. That's all I'm saying. Just let him... Just, he'll come out when he's ready. Okay. But you know what? what the thing about Mickey Fio said that the fans deserve to know if the fight... He's got fans all around the yeah, world. Yeah, but Mickey... Why don't you approach John in private and sort it out behind closed doors like normal boxers do? Yeah, he don't want to do no street fight, he said. He said, he, he said he's not a mug. No, nah, but, nah, but why don't you speak to John in private and say, yo, do you think, think is, is John... it going to happen? Am I wasting my time? Should I, you know what I'm saying? Like, like how? Approach him privately. There's no way for him to, 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 to contact John. Otherwise, yeah, like he's, like he's a from uh, Black, Blackpool. He said that the, 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 the Spencer Brown does not reply to any of his messages. So, what, so what's that say to you then? The fight's off, isn't it? Not necessarily. Listen, listen to me, right? Yeah. In in this boxing world, as you know, it's all about promotions. All about cat and mouse. It's all about one minute they want to fight, next minute they don't want to fight. Until you hear something conclusive, unless you hear something a statement, then you know if the fight's not. You don't know if the fight's on or not. You've seen it with Wilder and AJ. We've seen it with with all of those are boxers. It's it's boxing politics, right? And this is what this is what fight fans were used to it by now. Until it's actually a statement comes out says they're not fighting or they don't want to know or whatever reason, then it's still in our eyes, it's, it's still on. Yeah, but sometimes you've got to read between the lines of that, Colin. Yeah. This is a big sometimes you've got to read between the lines. Sorry? Sometimes you've got to read between the lines. So you, in your mind, you think it's off? Yeah, I think it's off. And when John sees him, they'll have a little roll around on the cobbles. 
<laughs> that's what. That's, then apparently, John Fury is still on license. He can't. He can't do that shit. That's what Mickey Fury said. John don't care about that, bro. Fuck it. Yeah. He's he's on he's online making all sorts of friends. That's the last thing on his mind. Yeah, apparently, apparently, there's no threats he made. Apparently, <laughs> Brown, his agent has told his trainer Noel that um. You know, the police are going to shut down the fight anyway because of... Yeah, yeah, it's too much stuff being said, man. It's too much stuff being said. The police are not happy about it. They want to shut down the fight. But now, Ricky Theo said in his interview with me that that's an excuse because there's no, that's just, they, they're just saying let's get out of the fight. It, yeah, it's a shame that this happened between lockdown because this could have crept under, like, you, it would have been around like Billy or it would have crept under the big, big fights. But because we're in lockdown, it's like the main fight, isn't it? It's like, a fight. There's nothing else. It's the main to fight. It's the, it's the biggest fight of the year. Biggest fight of the year? Yeah. Biggest fight of the year? It is, it is, it is. I can't lie to you. You know what? If this fight doesn't happen, it's always a consolation prize. Like, Sam Jones. Heavy versus Sam Jones. That can, that, that can turn. Can you imagine if... That, if yeah, but that's the headliner. That's the headliner. But I'm saying, in its own right, Heavy versus Sam Jones is a main event fight. But... Can you imagine this? Imagine this. Imagine if the, the Mickey Fear on John Fury doesn't come off, which I want it to. Don't get me wrong, I know it, I want it to, because I think this fight has absolutely got it all. It's got it all. You can make a movie out of this fight. Yeah. A movie, mate. But I'm saying if it doesn't come off, there's a possibility that Heavy D. Sam Jones could be the biggest fight of 2020. How's it going? Yeah. I, I, I reckon that. Uh, Heavy D. being the biggest fight. Of 2020. The, the, it, well, the, stranger things have happened. Do you know what I'm saying? It's a fun game. It's a fun it's, it's game. Funny old game bro. You got to speak into you, you got to speak into existence. You got to speak, yeah. and it happens. It doesn't happen by itself. Yeah, I've spoken into existence. The universe, yeah. the, the, the universe has answered my call. Yeah. You mean the opponent, Sam Jones, and it could be. The biggest fight of 2020. This is could yeah. be mental. <laughs> you know what I mean? Who would have thought it? Who would have thought the boom they are being the biggest fight of 2020? I reckon it can't go on. I, 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 I hope, I hope, I hope you, John, Mickey and Sam are like way well paid and I hope the fight goes on and I hope you all get a fair bit of change, man. You know what I'm saying? But, we, it'll, uh, it's, we don't know. So we're doing it for charity and stuff. We're doing oh, you're doing it for charity? We're doing it for charity. Yeah, yeah, but we, we, yeah, but heavy. I, I think heavy D needs to get paid, in my in my humble opinion, which might not mean much, but well, you you'll, you'll be bringing, you'll be bringing, doing a lot on the gate. That's not my driving force. My driving force is to um, to raise a bit of money for charity and to get. What, what charity are you doing it for? Well, it's supposed to be for NHS. You know, you know, I'm speaking for NHS. But like I said, there's loads of charities that are close to my heart. You know, there's loads of those charities that are close to my heart. So, do you know what I mean? Like, we'll come, we'll come to that. I mean, obviously, there's been talk about... Um, there's loads of, there's loads of, loads of charities. You know what I mean, I'd love to do some, cha- you know, some, some, you know, UNICEF or, or something like that. Or, you know, yeah. Like, you know, sponsor it's a good cause, man. That's, that's the most important thing. Because John Fury, I, he can make a lot of money for the NHS, I think. Can be also right, yeah. Is it NHS a charity though? Do you do you class NHS as a charity? I do think I do think, I do think they're overpaid and under uh, overworked and underpaid. I'm just saying that the NHS should not be a charity. We're treating yeah, it as a charity. It's, it's a free healthcare though. It's free healthcare, but is it a cha- it's not rich for charity? Have a look online and see if it's, it's not registered as a charity. No, no, but we, we do owe a lot today, NHS, do you know what I'm saying? Okay, we do fundraising, we do fundraising. I fundraising, that's the right word, yeah, I mean, that's the right I word. Like Mary Curie for cancer. I'd like to do something for like um, Balls to Cancer, it is a charity close to my heart. Um, I'd like to do things for like you know, Great Ormond Street. I like, I've done, yeah. These are things I've done from the past. Um, you know, um, little kids that are, that are, that are that, you know, um, on life support machines. Stuff like that, man. Stuff that can touch your heart, you know what I mean? Mm. You know what I'm trying to say? Is? So, no, okay. Okay. Like, you, know, you know, there's so much charities out there, worthwhile charities out there. You know what I mean? And the fact of the matter is, you know what, man? What's six minutes? I'll get in the room for six minutes or whatever and stuff. And, and I'll, you know, I'll, I'll the John fight then. Well, they, they, they were talking about four, 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 two minute rounds. 
But I to be fair, that's a three rounder. What? At that age, they should do three rounds, I reckon. They should do three rounds, but Nicky Theo talks says, says he wants 12 rounds. But I think he's just, I think he's just saying that. Oh, look, I, I know he wants 12 rounds. But at the end of the day, you know what? It's not a title fight. Why he wants 12 rounds? I love Mickey Theo, but you know what I mean? Let's keep it, keep it friendly. If they're going to fight, give it two, three, two minute rounds and give everyone a chance. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, I get you. Because everyone's, you know what I mean? At the end of the day, it's like, yeah, do you know what I mean? It's supposed to be for Terry. It's not supposed to be serious. You know what? Those sort of late rounds, man, something bad can happen. Do you know what I mean? Uh, John, John has turned it into a bit like a bit too serious, isn't it? Don't you think like, it's taking it a bit too too personal? Too, too into heart. Yeah, John's got John's got a bit too. But that's John, though. You, you, it's you don't, you, about, it's you, not that he's gonna he's gonna fucking break his jaw. And all shall I tell you the truth? You, you don't wait awake a sleeping dog. Well, you don't wake up a sleeping dog. Do you know what I'm saying? But I'm saying, yeah. What I'm trying to say is another thing as well. If someone's going to do something, they don't tell you they're going to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But John, John, John's, an, John's an exception to the rule, man. John's, John's made a heavyweight world champion, man. Still the man sitting to yeah, him. That, say, that's winning today. You don't say on the internet. It's a millions of people online. Yeah, but look at John's CV, bro. It's not a joke. He's not lying at you, bro. But, listen, but still, I hear what you're saying. But in the normal circumstances... You don't chat to millions of people on the internet, then they get to do something. Yeah, but I think I think that's an I think that's an um an ex- he's a, 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 a rare exception to the rule. Someone, you wouldn't tell millions of people on the internet. But I think he's a, he's a, he's an exception to the rule, bro. Because you know what he's doing. He's he's like he's got a big job at BT now. They've just let him in the studios. He's he's presenting on when his son fights the biggest gig, which are watched by Tyson Fury is a big name now. You can't really be speaking like that on the internet. Do you know what I'm saying? Because you might lose his gig at BT Sports now. Uh, but do you know I, what I'm saying? That's I, what he's Yeah, but who, who, who's, who's, who's advising him to, to, to do that? Someone's, someone's, I don't think you can tell John what to do. Okay. But I, 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 bro, I, I, I feel like you are direct John a little bit. I do, I do. I'm, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not judging him. I know you're not judging him. But you, you're, you like. I just feel that if you're gonna do something, not you, but the public, the public are underwhelming John Fury. When he hurts people, he's the only one that's gonna be doing the the the, the, the uh the, the bad proof. Look, Mickey Theo has said that he he hasn't seen him fight for twenty odd years. Yeah, no one's seen John Fury fight. I, I I've been looking for footage for years. Yeah. So, so. look, I want to see this fight, and I'm sure a lot of people do. Right? Yeah. Uh, yeah. What do you think the percentage of chance of this happening? Five percent. Really? John's not on it, bruv. John, John, John. I think Mickey's. Well, well if that's the case, if that's the case with what you're saying that it's not on, shouldn't they put out a statement and say, "Do you know what? This fight's not happening." Don't waste your time. Don't stop talking about it. Stop giving it air time. Let's just move on. Move on with it. Everyone just move on with what they're doing. Don't yeah, but I don't think... I don't, yeah, but and then, George, then, then anyway, Mickey will stop talking about him. We'll stop doing our podcast. Everyone will not... We won't stop doing our podcast, people. The podcast will still carry on with other subjects. Don't get me wrong. But I'm saying, people will just will just, will just just stop stop talking about the subject. But the, 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 the internet moves very quickly, bro. Sorry? The internet moves very quickly. What does that mean? Which, which means, like, this, this will be forgotten about in one day if the fight's not on. Exactly, but you've got to put a stop to it. You've got, you've got to put a stop yeah. to all the rumours. The only way to do that is to put a statement there. I don't think... I don't, do you know what it is with John? I know, I know Mickey's just saying too much in interviews and he's fucking getting pissed off. I know that's what I'm saying. You can't stop people talking. No, nah, that's good. Yeah, any, any publicity is good a publicity, right? But I'm saying, if you're going to fight someone, if you're going to fight someone, right, yeah, they've got every right to call you a name or a chicken or whatever they want to do. This is me. In the world of boxing, they people get a lot, called a lot worse than a chicken. Yeah. Chicken, to be fair, this... A chicken is not really, like, really. I mean, look, he's called him a chicken, and John's called him a chicken. I mean, what's worse? <laughs> a chicken or a chicken? 
What do you reckon is worse? Shut the mullet pig, man. <laughs> oh, that, that's a deeper one, bro. Do you know what I'm saying? That's a dumb. You know how deep that that's is. That's a dumb, bro. That's a dumb. Shut the mullet pig. Come on, man. Look, the thing about it is, right, yeah? Mickey Fierro's not taking it personal. He's not going, oh, my God. You could be a Shepton Mallet pig. And all that. He's laughing about it. He's going, you see the pigs in, in, in Cyprus? He's going, <laughs> as he said, he looks as they got Shepton Mallet pigs in Cyprus. I spoke to him. He's laughing about it. But, like, you know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Uh, do, you, do you know what it is? I, I, I would love, love to know. What else to call someone a, a chicken? Do you know, oh. I would love to know. I would love to know how John gets no, so wound up on camera. He didn't say one. He used to just call him a pig. He called him a type of pig. He's not a pig. He called him like a breed of a pig. Bro, Shepton Mallet pig. pig. Bro. I had to Google it, you know, Shepton Mallet pig. I had to Google it. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a place called Shepton Mallet near Bristol as well, isn't it? Is it? I think it's but there's one up in Lancashire, isn't it? Oh, no, there's one near Bristol as well. They do a rave down there called Dust Festival. Yeah. Yeah, so I think he's. I thought, I thought he was on about there, but oh, do you know what, with John, I don't know how he could get so angry on the speech to a phone camera, bro. I, I couldn't get that angry to, on the phone. But that, that leads me to the other, to the other, other theory that it could be just a PR exercise. This Never, not with John. He don't need it, bro. He don't even need it. Man, you don't know, man. Don't know, man. Bro, his son's the world champion. What, what, what does what do he need? What, what, what are you drinking there, bro? Um, diet tropical crush. Oh, you, you feeling better? Yeah, man. I just done some training today. Ooh, Is it aching, bro? I tell you, man. Yeah, yeah. you look. You look like bro. I can see it in the face. You lost a couple of pounds already, innit? it? Yeah, bro. Hey, hey. I saw you on TikTok earlier, bro. You done, how, did, how do you remember how to do all them things? What? How, did, how do, you, do you did you remember the gunshots on 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 uh, TikTok earlier? No, no, no. You seen the TikTok? Yeah, that's that's hard to learn, isn't it? Do you think? <laughs> Do you think it's hard? Is it hard? Yeah, you, you got to listen. As you got to listen, you got to listen. But in a, in, 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 a, in a very busy crowd of gym, it's difficult to get to, to get it just right. But you know what people are like. You get one, you, you miss one beat, everyone goes, oh, you're doing it wrong. Oh, hey, you're hey, Am I allowed to ask, um, how, how come you're allowed access to the gyms? What? How come you're in the gym? Because there's only two people in the gym. Oh, you're social distancing, eh? Yeah, social distancing. Is it private? Listen, yeah, I was listen, checking, man. Work. Listen, listen. As long as, as long as you've got your social distancing, he's already said, Boris, that you can do that. Yeah, he did. He can do exercise for as long as you want. Listen, as long as you're social distancing, you can do whatever you want, mate. No, I'm just jealous, man, because I, 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 want, my, I want my gym to open up. You know what I'm saying? You've got to know the right people, bro. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm training for the biggest fight of 2020, possibly. Yeah. Of course, yeah. man. I can't, I can't be doing no park business, mate. I'm an athlete, bro. I need the best yeah. of the best training. I'm not saying I'm better than anyone else or more special than anyone else. I just am. Yeah. <laughs> Joke business. I'm only joking, people, right? Yeah. Don't go mad at me on the comments and all that and all this sort of stuff. I'm only joking. Jeez. But yeah, honestly, I need my training, bro. I'm, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm be quiet and I can't. This guy, Sam Jones, he's, he, he thinks it's a joke. He, think, he thinks I'm a joke. The man taking me yeah. for a joke, bro. Nah, I, I I I saw the conference. I think you're one nil up, man. But I hope Sam Jones don't pull out as well, man. I hope he doesn't. Did you see my Instagram? Dylan White supporting the heavy D. No way. What did he say? He said that today he went. He went. Um, I put the thing up right here because there, there was a there was a there was a um, like a oh. of who's gonna oh. be, of what the public Shaz put it up for pep talk of who do you think is gonna win? And fifty eight percent said heavy D, and Dylan White said underneath. He went, um, he went, um, let's go, champ. You and Sam Jones, let's get it. Let's go, champ. Let's go. So now he's no supporting, way. yeah. So Dylan White supporting Heavy D. Have a guess who comes up um, below that? Sam Jones. Is that he what goes, you say? Oh, oh, Dylan, can you be my trainer? He puts out some beg, bro. He's trying to beg, he's trying to beg my supporters, yeah? He's trying to beg my supporters going, oh, train me, Dylan. Train me, Dylan. Go and find your own, go and find your own supporters, right? Fight, um, um, he's got Joe Joyce there, man. Yeah, but Joe Joyce ain't Dylan White, is he? No, no, he's, he's not. Elite. He's not elite, is he? <laughs> he's he's not bad. He hey, Drekky's gonna beat Drekky's gonna beat Dubois. I think I like Joe Joyce. To be honest with you, 
Big Jack, yeah. I think he might, you know. I like Joe Joyce. I do like Joe Joyce. I do like it. I like his style. I've always, I've always, I've always said he's, he's good. You know what I mean? He's got good. He's fought some good, some good boxes. Joking aside, so he's done well. He's, he's done well in a short amount of time, isn't he? What? He's done well in a short amount of time. Yeah, but you know what I mean. He's done everything. He's done everything, he's done everything on on amateur level. Mm. And you know what? He's a bit of a late starter, but I like I like him. I think he's good. I think he's good. I think he'll beat. I think he'll beat the bar. Yeah, yeah, that's what I feel. I like boxers. Yeah. I like boxers, man. So, do you know what I mean? Like, you know, it's all good. Do you know what, right, yeah? See, do you know what? Well, you know, when, it's all about banter, right, yeah? Wherever you say things, people take this too literally in this day and age, man. And so everyone's supposed to be offended. You have offended me? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> you have offended me? You have offended me? You have offended me? Oh, oh, man. You can't even have a joke in this day and age, man. You can't even take yourself offended, man. No. <laughs> I have it, but you're, you're one of the funniest people I've ever met in my life, bro. I swear by that. Not know, many it, people make me laugh, bro. You know, you know, you know, you know, it, to, to offend someone this day and age, people are looking to get offended. They're waiting to get offended. Oh, you offended me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's crazy, but you're, you're too funny, man. Yeah. Like, this, this, this is going to be the best podcast of the roads, man. Listen, um, not moving on subject swiftly. Um, football's coming back. It's coming on. You know. coming. Football. How do you feel about that? What? How do you feel about that? It's good, man. Are you sure it's, it's true? A bit early, I think, though. What? Do you think it's a bit early? Nah. Nah, man. Oh, that can be too, that can be too early. I think it's just. I think it's just right, mate. Integrate it, mate. Integrate it. Yeah, most people are going crazy, but we need some sport, man. We need some sport. Yeah, but behind closed doors, have you, man? Have you, have you watched football behind closed doors before, mate? Nah. Awful. I know it's going to be shit, no atmosphere. It's going to be like a practice session, isn't it? But you, yeah. trust, me, trust me, that's going to be like a World Cup to us, mate. We ain't sport. Yeah. <laughs> World Cup, mate. Hey, hey, hey. You do a you do a you wave in the front room, do you know what I mean? Fucking hell, bro. Madness. Well, at least I get to see my team lift the league up, man. That's all I care about, man. Yeah, that's all you care about, man. I should be drinking this, but you know what? Nah, it's got zero calories. You're good. Diet. That's bar time, though, isn't it? You're not nah, but do you, know is? do you know what it is? Do you know what you're training? You need, your body needs some sugar, isn't it? Because you've been training all day. This is aspartame, though. It's fake sugar. But oh, okay. You know, after, after the end of the week, I'm not going to have no aspartame. I'm just going to drink pure water. Yeah, yeah. Just do your water, bro. I want to get in the comments section to say, you can't drink aspartame. It's really bad for your body. And this thing, I know it's bad for my body, but I fucking love the flavour, man. Yeah, but well, do you know what? We need um, we need some excitement in our day, don't we? Yeah, so yeah. You start to look forward to. You start to look forward. If it's a little bit of a fizzy pop, diet fizzy pop, it is a little treat, man. Yeah, you have to eat something, man. You know what I mean, bro? You know what I'm saying? We need listen, it, bro. Listen, mate, we're gonna wrap this up, right? Yeah, we're gonna do this every yeah. day. Yeah, every day. You have to do it every day. I'm on, I'm, on, I'm on it every single day, bro. Every day, I'm on it. So listen, we're gonna wrap this up, right? Yeah, if you haven't liked. Comment and subscribe. Make sure you do it now. Heavy sickers. Big up, bro. Boom.